Warm welcome to those if you are watching the uh, replay version of this first look expert division Mirage 9 hole cup. Don't forget to hit thumbs up on the video, make sure you are subscribed to the channel, hit the bell button as well, get the notifications enabled. Bear in mind these are first looks at the new wins. We are not going to be dialed in. I have no uh, intention of shooting a minus 17, but I have every intention of showing you the wind arrows, trying some routes out, and then if it works, it works. If it doesn't work, we will discuss some tweaks and some alternates as well. A little bit pushed for time, so it is going to be straight in, no tokens. So let's go. Gary Brown, two minus 15s in master, minus 13 in expert, well played. Um, I played main account at the end of the day on Thursday, shot a minus 14, and uh, with that, actually lipped out on hole three as well, which was a real shame. Played the bounce over shot um, rather than the rough bump, because the rough bump was a little bit scary for me on hole three in master. So played bounce over, and uh, yep, yeah, like I said, did a 360, which was uh, unfortunate. Uh, but these things happen right I'm just going to see if we have uh, any guides here that we've used before I'm pretty sure this is going to be a slice job on hole one so just going to have a look do remember there being a slice at some point here but I can't remember where it was okay so we've done a slice the opposite way Because I remember coming up with the shot. Um, da, 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 da. Let's have a look. Having said that I wouldn't do a token, I might actually do a token very, very quickly on this first one. See if we can get a slice. Uh, Izad, how are you doing? Gemma White, good morning. We had cross headwind in the opposite direction uh, for the palm tree actually and I, I do remember this shot because I came up with it. Uh, so I'm going to just, I'm going to try this Graham straight on the water white ring by the edge. Now I've got my setup point for the other direction so I'm going to move that across and just see. It's actually more direct headwind than I thought. Okay let's have a look. A navigator, I won't be using a navigator. <laughs> Guillermo Vega, thank you for the good luck. Good morning to you. Carp de Com, welcome. Good to see you as well. Thank you for the good luck. Uh, right, we're going to quickly do a slice here. I don't see any point in trying uh, bouncing over on the left side in this wind, to be honest. GC Jones, good to see you. Thank you for the good luck. And yep, yeah, indeed, good luck to everybody. It's the mini, you know, you've only got today to play. GC Rousey, welcome. Good to see you. Tom McDonald, how you doing? Going to watch a couple of holes before you go to sleep. Thank you so much. Uh, so let's try, I don't know, let's try, let's try that, shall we? Let me have some right spin before. I'm just going to go to right spin. We're going to go fixed position only and see. So we've got white ring, to the second cut of rough. Let's see where this goes. Okay, needed to go more rings. But that's okay. I think we're going to try um, another two rings. But that's okay. And obviously, if it doesn't work, you can tweak it from there. So let's go straight in. Let's go straight in. Okay, here we go. Yeah, a bit further out. Graham G, good morning. Got all three through. Thanks for your help. You're very, very welcome and well played. Well played indeed. Okay, let's go. Let's go. Yeah, I know I said no to no tokens, but you know, sometimes with a slice you have to try one out and it's only gonna be one shot. Only gonna be one shot. 
So uh, I'll try and discipline myself and not do any more tokens. <laughs> it's so it's so tempting though. You know, you just oh, I just try this one out. Hi, uh, how you doing? Good to see you. Thank you for the good luck. <laughs> Only one, I hear that's all I know. <laughs> okay, so we need to go uh, some more rings then. So we did that before. So let's go another, you know, I think another two and a half rings, two rings. Let's try two and a half. And I'm going to go half a bar of right spin. Let's see if it works. It works. If it doesn't, it doesn't. We go full power slice. Hopefully not going to hit the tree. God, that's close to the palm tree there. I nearly hit the tree trunk. It's good though. It's a good shot. But God, that was close to the tree. <laughs> That was so, so close to the tree, I'm not going to lie. Tom McDonald, second tee notes are excellent. Uh, well done. Thank you so much. Helped you get through seven, eight, and nine. Aziz, how you doing? Thank you for the good luck. Uh, Amitaj Burke, thank you for the good luck and love from India. Uh, Gabby Pavel, streaming on Monday morning. Streaming on Monday morning. I think we took some of the bark off that palm trunk there. Oh, nice, Graham. Thank you. Okay, so let's see what we can do on this one then. Right, we are at min sniper here. You know what? I'm gonna gi I'm gonna give this a go. I'm gonna give this a go. Um, and see what we can do. Okay, we're gonna go 6.3 rings. Might need some pull angle here, so. We'll see. Ah, great ball as well. Let's see if we even hit the rough. We did hit the rough. Great ball misses left, so uh, we over adjusted that. I played min zero. Uh, previously, we've played this minus five. So I'm thinking get, definitely go with minus five, maybe even a bit more than that in terms of negative elevation, to be honest. Not bad though, at least we contacted the rough. You've got to watch uh, the pull there because you can, if you get the pull angle wrong, miss the rough completely. Or, worse, go in the sand. So, a couple of uh, things to think about on that one. Bagus, thank you very much for the good luck. Uh, Sam Pritchard, thank you. Paul McFadden, how you doing? Um, Golf Clash Johnny, yes, I will be doing pro, definitely, on Monday. Okay, hole number two. Oh, that's kind of send it win, that is, isn't it? But let's, um, in the interest of time, might actually play with the rock and see if we can go sniper. Obviously, if those want to send it, can do. Seeing if we've had a send it on this in the past that I can have a look at, but I don't know if we have. Uh, we've had send it in the other direction with the APOC and a Zerk. That I might go rock to be honest. Noah Wild, thank you for the good luck. Like I said, if I had time to do a to do another token, then I I would do so. But I <laughs> I can't be late for work. 
Right. Let's have a look what we've got here then. Noah, thank you very much. Like in the Ball History series. Thank you. Thank you very much. Oh, have you got a send it guide in the guns chats, Graham? I don't think I'd I don't think I'd be able to uh get the thing open in time. It's very it's very tempting though. Very tempting. Um, eight. Okay, let's go with the rock. Give myself a bit of room here. Don't want the flat bounce. Max plus ten at nine point one. Oh, mine are great. Should be okay. Hey, Jacob Salter, thank you for the good luck. That's going to be okay. Uh, my Aunt Raj Poot, thank you very much for the good luck. And uh, the best wishes. Much appreciated. Uh, yeah, as Aziz says, hope you're all doing well. All good to see you, as always. In the weekend, what have you got planned? Anything interesting? A load of golf clash. Uh, the master account that we're going to do next is going to be the APOC 5 one. I'm going to save main account till later on. Because um, I've got a minus 14 on the main. I want to try and... I'm actually going to play competitively on that. So I'll use this morning's one as the as the trial, you know, as the guinea pig. Um, and then, you know, we'll see what we can do on main. Uh, since it is a send it win, you could have tried with Zerk. Yes, I could have done, um, but as I said, I'm pushed for time today, so uh, I really didn't have time to spend the token on hole one, but I did. But I've, I've got to limit myself now because I do have to get to work. So I had to pick one and um, decide to go with the rock. So if uh, you have a token, my advice would be stick a token on, try send it with a Zerk. I do believe... Uh, that shot will be on, absolutely on, really. Okay, I'm actually going to try um, max 20 here, 11.2. Oh god, that was a really crappy release. God, like a double grade. It's over adjusted anyway, though, because um, that was a bad grade left. So definitely didn't need twenty. Could have gone fifteen or ten on that. Yeah, don't get into trouble at work. No, I certainly won't. But you know, if you don't fancy blasting it, quarterback, rock, sniper, power three is fine. However, my advice, even though I've obviously not shown the aggressive option, it's a mini. I think sometimes if you know, if you are playing competitively and not for content like me, then um I think it's gonna be no guts, no glory really, to be honest. Uh, don't forget to hit thumbs up on the uh, stream as well if you've not done so already. Can we get our way to fifty thumbs up? Liam Backhouse, how are you doing? Good to see you. Um, GC Rousey, in your opinion, is a digital upright a good place to start learning? Conscious of space. Uh, yeah, I think that's a very good move. I think it's a very good move in that case. Uh, right, let's see. We got the boats. The boats. Level crosswind. That's not going to be a bad wind to attempt the rough bump, actually. To be quite honest. Um, okay, let's uh, let's give this a go. Uh, 
Uh, we may fly the green. We may hit the sand on this one just as a warning. Let's see what we're going to do though. Oh, the scorecard. I've totally forgotten the scorecard. Thank you for the reminder. There we go. Right, let's see. Um, what do we got? Nine. Oh, God. Okay, we're running out of time, so we're going to have to just get this shot away. And just see if we need any pull angle, to be honest. Perfect away. Let's have a look. No. Okay, flown the green. So we'll try that again. Uh, we need to obviously pull a little bit further back so we're gonna have another look at that actually we gave it a perfect played it one on one it's actually nice to have a second look at that let's see if we can hit the rough uh, Jason Bourne used to play through for qualifying it worked well wonderful axe man good to see you Jeff Burkett welcome as well 2 a.m. could you pipe down a bit <laughs> Okay, that's actually quite a decent outcome there. We can we can give that another go. Um, I tried to do a straight pull on that, so uh, so we could either set up further back, you know, set up and then do the pull back, or um, you know, or pull back afterwards. Right, let's have a look. Bit of top spin was it, or was it back spin? I can't remember. I think it was about there. Eight point seven. Nice to have similar wind strength. So let's do. Let's do the eight seven. I'm going to pull back as well. Let's try that. Let's try that. No, still flown the green. God. Okay, two attempts on that. Missed the rough both times. So obviously need a massive change on that one. That was with like a 0 0.8, 0 0.9 ring pullback. Uh, min plus five. Oh, interesting. Uh, Will Trotter, cousin's wedding. Awesome. Klaus, greetings from Stuttgart. Four-year-old daughter, Aisha, she's watching in. If she sees you smile every time, good game. Thank you so much. HTM vibes. Good to see you as well. All right, so Mr. Ruff twice, um, which obviously isn't great. But uh, like I said, you know, I'd rather have two attempts than just play a bounce over, which isn't really going to benefit too many people. Uh, decent wind on this one, though, so let's go Thor's Hammer or a POC. Let's carry on. It's so like I said, either need to uh, either need to set up much further back or do much more pullback. Um, always an issue with that rough bump. It's a very, very technical. There is not much room for error. In terms of pullback, I would have said maybe another another half ring, or in, in honesty. Uh, Dan Coronel, good morning. Uh, good luck from Vegas. Thank you so much. Thank you. Jason's liking the purple lighting. It's not my doing. It's it's hotel room job. <laughs> I'm glad you like it. Right, so let's see if we can get into rough bump range then. Johnny, these streams are great even when you fail. Absolutely. Like, you know, some people, thankfully it's a minority. Um, 
kind of don't appreciate the fact that, you know, I could shoot a minus 16, yet, yeah, and that'll be useful. But a minus 12 or, or whatever is still going to be as useful because if it doesn't work, uh, we look at tweaks and we look at how to change. If it does work, then you replicate. So, you know, there's stuff to be had from content, and that's the same here and the same everywhere else. Uh, even if things don't go to plan, you, you learn from it and you change. Right, we do want to make sure we clear the rough here which we just clipped in the qualifying round. So max 10, going to push up just over three rings. So 6.2. I'm going to go three and a half rings on. Oh, didn't feel like it great. Let's see. Right, we have missed the rough. Do we get the glitch roll? We do get a speed roll, but it is going to pull up quite nicely there, so that's okay. Kai, thank you very much. MJ, much appreciated as well. Tuk Tuk Yuk Tuk, how are you doing? Thank you for the good luck. Master coming up after this one. Did anybody take their account into Master for the first time on the Mini? Obviously it's a brilliant opportunity to do to do that. Try a new division, see if you like it, see if you don't. And like I always say, even if you just qualify in Master and completely ruin your round at the weekend, you've still got some luminaries for your trouble. No worries, Axeman, thank you very much. Hamish Philp, thank you so much for the good luck. Greatly appreciated. And I missed Gemma White with a donation. Give Gemma some love in the chat, please. Much, much appreciated. Okay, let's have a go here. Rough Bump is going to take us down into the sand with the adjustment. I'm kind of mid, just over mid here, so we'll maybe go... I don't know, maybe 55% slider, just over one on one, 8.4. So rather than push up afterwards, I'm actually going to push up. No, I'm not. I'm going to push up afterwards. <laughs> 8.4. And then we are going to push up. Because we dropped to a lower point. Let's see if this is enough or not. Did one ring, I think. Oh, it's close. Close. Good, good attempt, though, for a first look. I'm, I'm pleased with, the, with that effort, to be honest running out of time a bit but um, that seemed to be okay caught the rough maybe slightly lower than I was aiming but not too much maybe you know quarter of a ring half a ring um, five more thumbs up to get to 50 thank you so much would be very kind uh, went from expert two from pro three hit a palm leaf on eight and it was like hitting a barn door I know it can be like that so so irritating when that happens you just got to catch it at the wrong you know just a little bit can just get you in the water yeah congrats for your son's wedding axe man hope it goes well hope he has an awesome day uh what do we got here then the dolphin mm, okay let's have a look Okay, we could do Goliath, we could do uh, Sniper. It's all, it all depends how much Tailwind we have here. I'm kind of thinking just to try the Sniper. Try out a, a Sniper Rough Bump. As I say, I'm not bothered what I score here. Uh, Julie, thank you very much. Hope you're doing well. Ryan Langford, thank you for the good luck as well. Let's see, if we've got more crosswind, then I'll do sniper. 
No, I think I'm gonna go Goliath actually. I think I'm gonna go with the Goliath. That's we need to put more top spin on though, because I was way short of top spin last time. <laughs> way short so let's try nine one like five seven let's go max fifteen If you have Grizzly, use the Grizzly in level 9, using Goliath because uh, of lack of distance. Boom! Max plus 15. There we go. I redeemed myself in par 3 to <laughs> stakes. <laughs> Darts with Daniel, thank you for the boom. Aaron's back, he's been watching the horses. Ah, uh, came third. Nice. Cheers, Rousey. There we go then, that's, uh, that's a keeper, as they say. Cope with that. Bill, thank you for the good luck. Peru, cold spell, 12 degrees. Can we replicate same shot in pro? Absolutely. Absolutely, Akshay, that's, that, that'll work. Second tee in Tailwind. Um, I wouldn't necessarily be going for that in headwind at all. Thank you for the boons. There we go. Okay, we'll pick up a nice little chest. Whether it's full of nice things or not, I don't know, but we'll see. Okay, uh, hole six then. Uh, let's see what wind we're going to have here. Oh, that's nice. That's very pleasant. That's very pleasant indeed. I was expecting... Um, and mind you, to be honest, we had a stinker of a wind, didn't we? In, uh, in qualifying rounds, so... The coffee is on the go in the chat. Enjoy your coffee, everybody. I'll be grabbing one on the way in, I think. Super Ted, how you doing? Uh, I've no idea what spins I used. It was a decent amount of top spin, and I think three bars of left spin, but m maybe somebody can rewind and, and let you know. I didn't write them down. Two rings push up here, max plus 10, 5.9. Oh, great ball, god damn it. Amigo Marco, how you doing? Good to see you, Marco. Thank you very much for the uh, best wishes. We're okay with a great ball there. Um, yeah, if somebody is able to rewind and just put the spins in on that for hole five would be very much appreciated. From what I remember, it was a, a few and a bit bars of top spin and three left, um, but I may well be wrong. Thank you for the good luck, Super Ted. Sorry if I don't know if I missed you or not there. And Quasar, yeah. I mean, to be honest, you can play with a Titan on this one. Uh, thank you, uh, Abhijit. Three and a half top, three left. Tyron, how you doing? Good to see you. Long time no see. Vivek, welcome. Good to see you as well. Thank you for the good luck and best wishes to you. you Will, you cannot rewind on Tommy's streams now he's dropped YouTube. You know, I'm, I'm like I said on Thursday, I'm, I'm still a complete novice on Twitch in terms of, not as a streamer, because I'm not going to stream on Twitch, but a viewer. I don't know where to begin. I've tried. <laughs> There we go, and thanks Aziz. So maybe a bit over three and a half. 
top spin. I thought it was a bit a bit over that. Okay, outside chance of an albatross, but still probably a decent go at it. I'm going to get a bit of a wind push on this, aren't we? So I want to try and leave it a tad bit short. Maybe not that short, though. Okay, max 20 is going to be 10.3. Uh, nearly running out of time there, sorry about that. I need to improve my uh, shot clock management. This is going to miss high with the great left. It's not a million miles away though. I think perfect would have missed slightly low. Ruby, how you doing? Good to see you. Um, Thanks, Ryan. I mean, you know, I think there's definitely more precise people than me with adjustments, especially as I'm sometimes faffing around talking to the chat and not sure what I'm doing. But um, I, I do like turning around the bullseye and pushing up, you know, looking back at the T and then pulling back towards you, as it were. I think that's much better because you can zoom in. Usually I used to like still look along from the line of the shot and push up away from the where I was looking but I do think um, the other method you know like pulling back towards yourself you can zoom in a lot more you know thanks Tyron much appreciated uh, Ruby are you looking forward to Park de Paris I am actually it's not uh, could be worse could be City Park you know I feel I know the course fairly well uh, People's Champ, how you doing? Thank you for the good luck. I don't like hole three on Park de Parry. That's a pain. Okay, near a four top spin then. Thanks, Kane. Decent wind on hole six, actually, to be honest. Right, what we got next? Triple Island. Let's see what we're going to get. And then we've got uh, two holes to go after the next par three. Then we get a master. We're on schedule. We're on schedule for my uh, work call as well. Yeah, bring the big dog or the cat. Or, or even like for that thing on hole three, if we do get decent wind, the guardian is good, isn't it? For the backspin for that approach. That um, that kind of plateau par three is a bit tricky, isn't it? In part the parry. That's that's worth a token or two. Okay, we're going to go sniper on this then. We're going to go sniper mid plus fifteen, which is I think last time I checked. Um, no, I'm going to not say that because it isn't that. <laughs> I thought it was an easy to remember adjustment, but it isn't. Yeah, I agree, Julia. I've actually messed up hole three in part the parry with some, uh, and it's a narrow fairway on that. You know, minor great can just get you in the rough. Okay, mid plus 15, going to go 8.7. Perfect away. Ryan Langford, thank you for becoming a member on the channel. Can we give Ryan some booms and love in the chat, please? This is a, such a difficult par three. 
Speed is good, just need to um, change the left spin or aim more left, but it's a good speed. Mid 15. Thank you so much, Ryan. Uh, if you shoot me a message on uh, Messenger, here's the link. Uh, we'll get you added in to the chat. And if you refresh the stream, you will be able to unlock the uh, emojis. So, uh, rumour has it that there's going to be a bit of a Ryder Cup collab next month, next season in the game. A couple of Ryder Cup balls planned, I believe, and a Ryder Cup mini. Only rumours at the moment, but it is. Uh, we have had them in the past, so I would be surprised if there wasn't anything. Obviously, be next season. Oh, Bill, you had an argument about algebra. No one needs to have a degree. Is the practice the same in any European nations? Here to teach in um, in kind of mainstream schools, you do need to have a teaching degree. Uh, if if you're a teacher in like a what they call public schools, which are actually private schools where you have to pay, as in not state funded, you don't have to have a teaching degree. You, anybody can teach there, but definitely in most um, you know. State, stund uh, state funded education here in the UK you do have to have a teaching degree I don't know about the rest of Europe though. and of course last weekend of the season isn't it new season uh, starting Monday so see what they're going to chuck in the golf pass yeah, ok do need to swap to the Grizzly. This seems to be more crosswind than headwind so I might try and just push this um, push this drive out to the right. I know it's a bit a bit of a glitchy second shot but let's have a look. Fred Lee, how you doing? Oh it could be Eagle Peak. Oh please not City Park. I agree Super Ted but that's a very good shout that. It's a bit headwindy this isn't it you know what I'm gonna blast this I'm gonna try and blast this and just see what happens um, I'm gonna have to put some overpower on uh, 5.3 max 10 a bit of a weird wind angle this I know that that the uh, rough bump is a bit glitchy from this side but Seems a bit tricky to go left side in this wind. So I'm going to put a few rings on and just see if we can get a perfect away. Okay, we did get a perfect away. I needed more curl though, which is a pain. Um, problem with more curl would have hit the rough on the right so I would suggest just setting up another ring to the left on that one yeah Dubai is awesome to be honest but thank you Ryan much appreciated okay we're still gonna get the birdie on that obviously Yeah, I totally agree, Aziz. I, I had a great time over there. Sit. That's unlucky. It would have been a nice drive if that had parked up as well. Okay, what are we going to try and do? We, should we try Nirvana Rough, but just for the hell of it? Just for giggles, as they say. Now you see, there's the glitch. See that? That's that's the issue with 
with playing this side you know is, is you do get that to do with anyway we're, we're using the nirvana and it's not even nine in the morning so my hopes of hitting perfect on this one are slim to none <laughs> of course you hit perfect when you don't need to God. <laughs> oh dear isn't that just funny when that happens uh, I worked at the um, the Dubai Opera, which is next to the Dubai Mall and by the Burj Khalifa. I went up to the top of the Burj, did the water park, um, visited a few other places as well. I had a look around the Palm and the Marina, which you see here. Some of the skyscrapers that you see in the Oasis, it's it's just like the marina uh in in dubai um do i play 10 on the second shot i think generally i do actually yeah the the burj sadly my budget didn't stretch to the burj al arab when I say the top of the Burj I obviously don't mean the very top I mean <laughs> there are two platforms you can go to I went to and I did go to the upper of the two not the very very top <laughs> Wade how you doing uh, yes I did ride a camel actually cars are coming out at Spa will catch a replay thank you very much Hamish I'd love to stop at the Burj Al Arab. Okay, one to go, then we're on to Master. Okay, let's pack the Guardian. For the second shot. We're gonna need some curl on this drive, it's gonna be uh that's it, 452 metres, Kai. He knows what he's talking about. I don't think my stomach would have coped being at the very top of the tower, to be honest. Yeah, I should do a vlog about Dubai, actually. It'd be a good one for the members. Okay, let's see what we've got here, then. to try and hit the rough and roll out I think here yeah. 8.3 actually going to go max plus 5 5.2 which is hopefully going to give me some room for the curl let's cheat myself up a bit there This shot clock seems really quick. I must just be dozy this morning. It's going to miss left, I believe. Okay, we've snuck it out there. Perfect ball, obviously, would have been more centre fairway. I need to wake up. This shot clock seems to be just three seconds ahead of where I think it is. The height of it, 8.28, yeah. And I think they are building taller ones, aren't they? Oh, you've been over there, Kai. Awesome. Did you enjoy it? Half the height of Scarfell Pike, yeah. You know, I mean, when I was over there, that was 2017, and there was, there was loads being built then. And I guess they won't have stopped. Oh yes, Bill, I bet in 1996 it was a different vista. That's it, yep, yeah, they are trying to crack the thousand meter, there you are. Okay, we're gonna be near a Max Guardian, aren't we here with that? 
you know, you could spend two full days walking around the Dubai Mall and still not see everything. It's huge. It's absolutely huge. Oh God, we might actually need some overpower here. Yeah. Go in between mid and max plus 10, 8.1. And this is a very similar wind to the shot in Master, actually, isn't it? You're going to lose a bit of distance adjusting over the, the rough here. 8.1. Going to need a few rings of overpower. Let's see. It should get over there. perfect wasn't in <laughs> and nor was it great <laughs> it wasn't there when you were there Bill so there we go so I think you know summing up expert aggressive on two is better four is a decent chance six half a chance hole one tough one five and three obviously needs a lot of work really if you want to do that finicky rough bump but minus 12 I'm not at all disappointed with that for a first look and obviously if you are playing expert the very, very best of luck. Hopefully there's some stuff there you can use and tweak. And uh, go and have a great round. Are we going on to master straight away?